homesteading to prepping to common horse sense, we are College Hill Farm. Welcome back to College Hill Farm. Well, today it's time to plant cabbage and cauliflower. Cabbage and cauliflower are pretty much uh, the same. They're planted the same, they're tended the same. So uh, my cabbage this year did a lot better. Did a lot better than my cauliflower, than my broccoli plants. My cabbage and cauliflower is a whole lot prettier. Now, I don't distinguish one from the other when I'm putting them in because they're planted exactly the same way. I don't care if I get the rows mixed up because the rows are going to be side by side anyway. So I'm going to go down through here and plant these, but I'm not going to use my pipe planter. This year, the ground was just so wet, I couldn't hardly get an opportunity to plow it. Well, when I plowed it, it was still too wet. So my pipe planter is not the optimum thing, but you don't have to bend over to plant these, and I'm going to show you how. Now, you don't have to bend over to plant these. Uh, you pop them out of their cells, then you can just drop them in the hill. Let me drop, I'm going to drop this whole four pack. Come on out of there. And they need to be 18 inches to 24 inches apart because they're a lot, they get to be a lot bigger than uh, broccoli plants. Now, once you've got them out there, all you have to do then is take your foot and step them in. Because this dirt is good and soft. Just step that right in and pull some dirt up to the front. Step it in, pull some dirt around. Step it in. Get up there. Yeah. Pull some dirt around. Pull some dirt that way to make it stand up. Okay, that's all you have to do for these. Uh, it doesn't take long to plant a 48 flat. I have 48 cabbages and 48 cauliflower to get in the ground. Okay, that's the first 16, I'll get at it. Okay folks, that's 96 broccoli, 48 cauliflower, and 48 cabbages. Now, some people ask me, do y'all actually eat all that? Do you run a market garden, is that what you do? No, if you uh, go to our channel and check out our uh, section on casual and complimentary prepping, you'll find out how much it takes for a family of just two to eat for a year. And I'll try and put that link right up here. Now, if you like this kind of stuff, this homesteading, do-it-yourself kind of thing, be certain to come on out to the channel, subscribe. We do this homesteading, prepping, gardening stuff every week, sometimes one, sometimes five videos. It all depends on what's going on in the homestead that week. Now, if you ring the bell, it will let you know when we upload a video. So with that being said, we upload them all on Sunday, and with that being said, it's time for me to get on to the next thing.